Alright, let's do the reverse string too. So we are given string S and integer K. So you have to reverse the first K characters for every 2K character counting from the beginning. So this question uh, has pretty poorly explaining like reverse first K character for every 2K character. So uh, this is what it means, right? So you have to re uh, reverse the first two, two character and every two character uh you need to reverse so uh basically you are going to remain cd for the same and you have to you have to reverse ef later and g your g your remain the same because for every 2k uh 2k character right so somehow like this right so in this case you only reverse a b to b a and then cd remain the same so uh, this idea is pretty simple um uh so you can use two pointer so I'm gonna just zoom in a little bit. So for every two k, right? So I have a for loop. So I'm not just uh, I plus plus. I'm gonna say I plus equal two two k. So uh, what does this mean? This is actually mean like when I equal to zero, right? So the sub substring you need to reverse is from zero to uh zero to two, right? I mean, but we don't want to include the two so which is a b right here is it so uh you need to have a uh, star index so star index is definitely starting from i and n index is actually depend if you at the end of the loop uh you need to do something else but in this case we need a b right a b is basically say i plus k minus one right so zero plus two minus one which is 0, 1, right? And then this will be 1. And the other one is that when you are at the end of index, you don't have a uh, remaining character to reverse. So you can just pick a star length minus 1. So you have to find out which is the minimum because when this is at the end of the index of the string, it, it will get out, out of bound, right? So this is pretty straightforward. So uh, we need we need char, right? Just to just to store the uh, S to char, right? so to convert the, every character from S to uh, char, right? Now I need an index. So I will traverse the entire loop, and then I say I plus equal to two times k, right? And this is basically for every two k character uh, coming from the start index, and you have a star index, right? Like when do you need to start to reverse? So it's going to stop for i, and then when you go to the end, it's going to match on me i plus k minus one. That will that will uh, this going to be the first uh first couple character right? And at the end, you need to think about it. Uh, think about it like if you don't want to get out of bound, right? It's going to be s dot length minus minus one. So uh, we are not swapping yet. So we have to swap based on these two index, right? So swap is actually using the while loop is better. So star n, star less than n, and I will just keep increment my star and decrement my n, right? Then I will have a chart n equal array at star, and then array at star is equal array at n. Array at n will be equal. Okay, array n will be equal, equal to 10. And everything else, basically, you need to return the string. But we are using a char array, so we can use this new string array. And this will be the solution. So let me run the test case and submit. So this is the solution. So let's talk about time and space. This is going to be time for every 2k, I mean, for every character you need to as your traverse is what all of them right but we actually um increment every single two times k right so it's going to be i would say log n based on uh, based on the k be honest and uh if k equal to one it's actually all of them right but if k equal to uh like 100 or something and 
this is definitely definitely depending on the install length but normally we say all of them right but if k is actually really large we actually can cut the time half right or more than half so using a log and this is going to be space all of them for sure no matter what how long should string so this is going to be all of them for, for space and this is normally i would say all of them full time as well and this is the solution and i will see you next time bye